Hello, hello, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hi. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Happy, happy day of teacher. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you happy very much. Teacher's day. Thank. Thank you so very much. How was your day? And you will remember today because it's the last class. <laughs> what a coincidence. <laughs> Yes, it's a very nice coincidence. Unfortunately, San Salvador is underwater. It's I see that. horrible. There was a horrible rain. Terrible, terrible. Yeah, some, it, some it participants, yeah, it rained a lot, but a lot, like three hours. I think it started like at three, oh, probably two hours, but it was really heavy rain. And it was with thunders and, and lights and everything. So it was really, really heavy. You can um, swim in the street. <laughs> definitely. No, the traffic, all the cars were stopped, like stuck in the middle of the street because of the water. There was so much water. And Para lo que no había llovido en San Salvador, dice. Exactly. <laughs> Todo lo que no había llovido, lo que va del año, que inviernos. <laughs> Supposedly, <laughs> supposedly we were, were supposed to be in winter, but it didn't rain. And on top of that, people are getting ready because tomorrow is the Olympics opening. Is the inauguration of the of the Olympics? So many streets were closed. Yes. Uh huh. So, so many events actually, so many events going on, but. Hopefully you are fine, you are okay, because some participants were coming from Santa Tecla to Soyapango, imagine. Definitely it's going to be about five hours in traffic. It's terrible, terrible, terrible. Especially the main streets, like the 49th Street near the stadiums and the streets, the Olympics near the, um, or I think, yeah, I think the Olympics near the Cuscatlan Park, near the hospitals, in the downtown as well. <sighs> so hopefully everything is fine. Nobody died because it, it, it gets really, really hard. But I hope you're fine. You're okay. Not much rain in your cities. No? Everything okay? Good. That's nice. Well, let's get started. Let me see. Let me get to the presentation. Yes, I have it right here. And as you said at the beginning, it's our last class, our class number 16. Actually, this course is pretty good because it's just four classes every week. So it goes like really fast. But you got to be very efficient also completing the exercises so that you already built the vocabulary knowledge when you have to be in classes. You already know what to do. You already know what to say. Ah. <laughs> like students say, ah. <laughs> okay. And yes, the reminders as usual. And of course, you all finished exam, final exam, and we are going to review. Review present continuous sentences and questions, okay? Yesterday we were just asking questions, WH questions about present continuous, and today we are reviewing affirmative statements or sentences, negative sentences, WH questions, yes, not questions as well. In pressing continuous, actually pressing continuous is one of the tenses that most people manage and use when communicating in English. Okay, so this is very, very good. All right, let's get started with the attendance. I see most people got connected and that's great. Thumbs up for you, big heart, big celebration. So because of my background, sometimes it's difficult to make the reactions. <laughs> I'm going to change that background probably for the next course. 
<laughs> because the yellow bar doesn't doesn't really let uh, no, this part actually doesn't really let show the the other reactions that are the same color. Okay, well, I see most people are connected, 20 people. Yeah, that's basically a great number. Okay, well, I see Adriana is connected already and she's the first one on the list. Adriana, how are you? Hi, you me? Good, thanks, I'm just okay. fine. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I'm just fine. Actually, yeah, today I didn't go to work. For the very first time in my whole life being a teacher, I didn't go to work. <laughs> okay. It was kind of weird when I when I heard the news. They said, no, you're not going to work. And everybody was like, really? Are you serious? Do you swear? <laughs> I have a teacher too, and he don't work today and tomorrow. Yeah. Yes, I found a friend who is already retired. She was a teacher for many years and she said, yes, it's official. We we didn't have to work today. And it's raining. If you listen to that, it's because it's raining. It continues raining, actually. So if my internet fails, it's because of the rain. Hopefully, no. Hopefully, I'm going to trust the company because yesterday at night, after we finished the classes, there was no internet. You know, it's like, oh my God, what happened? All right. Alma. Alma, Alma. Alma is not here today. Really. Unbelievable. What happened? No, it's not here. My goodness. Ana Beatriz. Present teacher. Hello, good evening. Hello, teacher. All right. Armando. Hello. And your father was a teacher of what? Of math, of science? Um... Primary? Primary school. Yes. Well, all the subjects. Uh, Math, Spanish, uh, science, uh, social study. All the subjects. Yes. Oh my God. That was a very yeah. complete teacher. <laughs> the principal of a school. Really? Nice. So you have to be a good student. You have no choice. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't study in the same school. He was a teacher. No, um, I studied in other. In another uh, school, in a private school. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I believe. Let's see. Uh, Brenda. Brenda. Esmeralda, I see you, but Hi, I present. Hi, how are you? How is San Luca life treating you? Are you cold? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay, Cristina Michelle. Christy. Where are you? I don't see you, Christine. Well, maybe she's not here yet. Diana, 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 Diana. Present. Hello, how are you? Fine. Just fine. Good. Okay, Elmer. Present. Hello, how are you, Elmer? Hello, fine, fine. Just fine. Not raining? Yes, yeah. Yes. It's raining. Mm, yes. Where? Mm, Metapan. In Metapan. It's raining in Metapan mm. too. Metapan is so beautiful. 
Erika. Hot is very hot. Sometimes it's hot. It's true. Nah, sometimes, no. All the day. time. <laughs> all the time. <laughs> but when it's raining, it's not hot. Uh. <laughs> I went to Metapan. I went to Universidad Católica. I worked for Universidad Católica. Some years ago. It's on the way to Metapan, actually. Fatima, Erika. Sorry. Same. Hello. Present. How are you? Fine. Just fine. Good. Fatima? I don't see Fatima. I don't know if I'm wrong. Freddy? Present. How are you, Freddy? Fine. Just fine. Did you work today? Good. Uh, Good. Right. Uh, rain. Right. It's raining. It, yes. Where? La Paz. In La Paz. Exactly. What city? San Rafael. San Rafael. San Rafael. Rafael. Nice. I had another another participant in the previous course that was from Santa Maria Suma. Mm -hmm. And I have a friend from, let me see what's the name of the, of the town she lives in, but it's in La Paz. It, it's near Zacatecoluca downtown, but it's called Barahona. Alma, I see you. Hello, teacher. Me acabo de conectar que aquí está cayendo una tormenta eléctrica terrible. <laughs> It's raining too. No oh, what a coincidence. <laughs> yes, I me know. It's raining everywhere. It's raining all over El Salvador. <laughs> It's okay. Don't That's worry. Fine. It's fine. Okay. Hey, so. Present from <laughs> uh, Armenia, Cincinnati. From Armenia, it's true. It's raining now. Yes, a little a bit. bit. A little bit. Yes. Nice. Great. So you are near Armando, right? Because Armando is from the city of Cincinnati, and you are from Armenia. Is that right? I can know. I don't know Armenia. Really? Eh, eh, yes, y yo no sé dónde es, dónde vive él también. <laughs> yo sí sé Armenia, pero nunca he entrado, nunca he ido. Really? It's on the, on the, on the road to, to Sonsonate, right? Eh, no. Eh, sí está de la, la ruta de San Salvador para, para Sonsonate. Mm -hmm. I remember. Que... I remember because my boss is from Sonsonate. And whenever we have a trip, he goes to that place. Uh, <laughs> so he always goes to that place, either to Huayua, to any of the places near Sonsonate. And I say, why don't we go to Chalatenango, La Unión? <laughs> he said, no, because I know this place and I know what to do. And I'm like, okay. So he explains sometimes where Armenia is. All right. Jocelyn, Tatiana. Present. Hello, good evening. How are you? Hello. Fine. Yes. All right, nice. Great. Carla? Carla Jamilet? Not here. Oh, yeah. sorry. Catherine? Hello, good evening. Hey, how are you, Catherine? Very good. Nice. I'm happy to hear that. Having Kevin Alexander? Present. Hello, how are you, Kevin? 
You okay? Yes. No. Not so good. Are you sick? Yes. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. También anda dando la delitis. Aguda. Hello? Esmeralda wrote in the group was WhatsApp. Oh, really? Oh, I forgot my phone today. <laughs> I don't know where I left it. <laughs> uh, I'm going to check here on the web. Oh, let's see. Uh, it's raining. All right. Elizabeth has the same problem. Well, thank you. Well, sorry. Okay. Kevin is sick. I'm sorry, Kevin. Drink some hot tea, honey, ginger, lemon, all those remedies that can help you improve your health. Maria Jose. Present. Hello, good evening. How are you? Very good. Very good, nice. Marisol. Hello. How are you, Marisol? Where are you from? I'm fine, thanks. Son Sonate too. Oh my God, the whole class is from Son Sonate. <laughs> <laughs> Many people are from Sonsonate. That's great. I see people from That's good. You can make a conversation <laughs> club. Why not? Actually, I I saw a video of a beautiful place in Sonsonate. Maybe we can go and have a cup of coffee. They say that is, I don't know if it is in El Antiguo ferr Ferrocarril or something like that. Um, there's a there's a very interesting cafe and, and it looks like twilight because of the big trees and it looks kind of how do you say this the concept kind of retro so it looks pretty nice maybe we can go someday all right melissa present hello how are you melissa i'm okay nice where are you from melissa San Miguel. San Miguel. Oh my God. Yes. And her signal very clear. You see? People from <laughs> San Miguel have money. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> A little bit. A little bit. <laughs> oh, nice. No, actually, I like, I always have participants from San Miguel and their signal is very nice. That's good. <laughs> okay. Nelvin Enrique. Olympia Valeria. Present. Good evening. Hello. Good evening. How are you, Olympia? Um, I'm fine. I'm hungry. I'm hungry. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't have dinner. <laughs> Not dinner yet. Yes. Oh, make some sandwiches or some cereal. <laughs> um, sandwich. <laughs> sandwiches. Fast. Yes. True. Roxana. Roxana, really? Present. Hi, how are Present. you? Present. Hello? I'm fine, thank you. Is it raining? No? It's not no. raining. <laughs> nice. It's not. To, a place that is not raining. Which is the city? Uh, Lourdes, Colón. Thank God it's not raining in Lourdes. Yes. Ruth Elizabeth. Ruth. Where is Ruth? No, she's not here. Unfortunately. Sandra. Hello. Hi, how are you, Sandra? Today don't feel good. You don't feel well. What happened? Mm -hmm. Because my son is sick. Really? Is he in the hospital? No. He's at home. In the house. Sick. But you told me you took your son to the to the doctor, right? 
Yes. Mm, did he get medicine? Sí. Thank God. So he's gonna he's gonna get better. Okay. Thank you. All right. Thank you. All right, Tatiana Maria. Present. How are you, Tatiana? Uh, fine. Okay, nice. I'm happy to hear that. Jadira? Present. Hi, how are you, Jadira? Fine. Fine, nice. At home? Everything okay? Yes? Yes. Okay, perfect. Jocelyn, Adeline? Present teacher. Hi, how are you, Jocelyn? I'm fine. Nice. Happy to hear that. Helena. <coughs> Hello, how are you, Selena? Good. Oh, good. Nice. Very good. All right, Selena, are you a singer? No. No? <laughs> but you have a guitar. Mm, estaba aprendiendo, pero eh, me decepcioné cuando me dolieron demasiado los dedos. <laughs> Tuvimos la misma experiencia. My father, my brother, everybody can play the guitar. Pero no sabía que de qué había que hacerle tanta fuerza. Pues, bueno, yo he cortado acá. Ajá, uh -huh. sí. Yo también desistí cuando vi que era demasiada fuerza. Ahí se, okay. Sí, porque no. Y ahora solo está en su house, the guitar. Ya no le toca a nadie. Nobody plays the guitar. No. <laughs> okay. My father continues playing the guitar, my brother too. But then I didn't play the guitar anymore. I just sing. Sometimes I sing, but not anymore. I just sing for fun, probably. In classes sometimes, but in virtual classes, it's not permitted because of the copyrights. One time I was singing, I didn't know. I was singing a piece of a song from the Beatles, and then I couldn't upload the video. I have to remove the part where I was singing <laughs> so it's very weird all right thank you very much for sharing anybody I didn't mention on the attendance I wrote two in the group somebody else okay let me check it out oh Christy oh yes Christy says uh yeah, so she's moving from Sayapango to Santa Tecla. I think she's the one that told me. Okay, well, we're gonna write that here. Yes, please, please. Okay, we're gonna make that comment. Huh? of the rain okay nice well as i mentioned before i have the review of the present continuous and we have this exercise okay i'm i am pretty sure yes you see the pictures one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So these have to coincide with the pictures here. One, two, three, number four is this one, number five, number six, number seven, we got number six here, number seven here, and number eight here. So number one is reading, number two, Washing. 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 He's washing. washing the dishes, probably, right? Washing the dishes. Uh -huh. Number three. Drinking. He's drinking. He's drinking juice, all right? Drinking. He's drinking something, right? Okay, number four. 
what's she doing? I don't know. Maybe she is playing, looking for something, checking some files on the cabinet. Okay, number five. Calling. She's calling. Oh. She's calling on the phone. She's talking on the phone. Number six. Eating. She's eating. 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 eating something, right? Eating. eating an apple, right? Okay, number seven. She's listening. Listening to music. All right, and number eight. Watching. TV. Watching, watching TV. Watching so there is this exercise on the web page. I'm going to share with you the link and you complete the exercise. All right. Okay. Give me one second. I just need to get to the link right here. Yes. Pretty cool. Okay. I'll paste it on the WhatsApp group so that you can access to it. All right. Please confirm if you can see the exercise. Yes? Mm -hmm. You've got it? Yes? Yes. But Did you open the link? Yeah. <laughs> Teacher, okay, yes. Hey, por qué en así en el, como el, en el segundo es un washing up? Sí, to be mm, probably Se a little bit washing up. A little bit general, porque no son tan específicos like washing the dishes. Uh -huh. Ajá. Uh, washing up is like washing something. Entonces ese si, tipo si, el lab es como para decir como que está lavando pero no se sabe qué y ya si es algo general uh -huh. si dice está lavando los platos ya se dice el washing y... the dishes or washing the clothes or washing the windows uh -huh. washing es como haciendo alguna sí. lavada de algo ah. uh -huh. okay good I'm going to give you around three minutes for you to compare your answers with a partner in case you still have some doubts, some questions, or something that you haven't completed, okay? But you just continue completing the exercise, okay? Let's see. In case you need to compare or ask questions to your partner about the exercise, you're going to be in a group, okay? Let's go. pero a mí ¿Ah? me salió que a mí me salió 5 de 10 entonces ya estoy viendo en qué me equivoca en qué me equivoqué um, en todo te sale eso no 5 de 10 sí pero o no sea, entiendo sí, o sea, cinco líneas de las 10 digamos que ustedes ya lo resolvieron ajá la mitad mm. tengo buena y la mitad mala mm. ¿Y usted? Yo todavía no, no tengo nada. nada. <ríe> ah, ok, ok. Ahí se nunca, ¿no? Sí. <ríe> Pero quizás por adelantar me salieron malas y eso no entiendo por qué, si según yo lo he hecho bien. Teacher, help me. <ríe> <ríe> Sí. Voy a consultar a ver qué me dice. 
Uh, teacher. Yes, tell me. Eh, ¿Tenemos que darle finish o solo ordenar? Yes, finish and check your answers. Ah, ok, mm -hmm. we finish. All right. And check my answers. It's... Miendo, ¿verdad? Ajá. Sí, sería he city. Ya el 7, el 7 es este. ¿Qué estaría haciendo el 7? Listen to news. Music. ¿Alguien ya las hizo? Yo las estoy haciendo ahorita. Eh, ¿Te hicieron una pregunta? Tell me. Eh, eh, en, 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 por, eh, ¿cuál, ¿Cuál, o sea, usted dio varios verbos, pero cuál uh -huh. sería el, el, el adecuado de todos los que dio? ¿En cuál? ¿En qué número? Cuatro. Número four. Yes. She is hiding up. Es como ordenando. De todas las opciones que le da es hiding up. Yes, pero usted, o sea, digamos, cuando estaba andando explicando usted y... Que ah, porque sí. igual yo no estaba como segura de las opciones que le da, esa es. Pero podría ser... Uh, setting something in a cabinet, checking files, porque no estaba segura como qué es lo que realmente está haciendo la chica. Pero de acuerdo al ejercicio está ordenando. Por ejemplo, cuando está ordenando el closet o está ordenando un mueble, podría ser uh, putting things in order, setting something in order, or tidying up. Ah, ok. Mm -hmm. A saber si las pone bien, porque les, se las tirará malas, error tal vez de la de la ajá, de la de la Teacher, help me. Sí, porque a mí ya me salió que es 5 de 10 en las dos. ¿Qué pasó? Ahí está la teacher. <risa> <risa> es que ya las he repetido veces y en mi conocimiento está todo bien, pero siempre me califica 5 de 10. Really? Sí, eh, voy a ver si puedo compartir pantalla. Ok. Para mostrarles. Ay, la bebé. <ríe> Cuando estaba más chiquita. ¿Usted? The baby. No, mi, my daughter. Uh -huh. Ah, es porque no ha he hecho la primera parte. Ah, ah sí. <risa> la parte que está en rosado. Ah, esa es de escribirla. No, solo oh. le da clic y ahí le da las opciones. Ah, sí. Ah, okay. En esa parte me decía yo, Hazel. Ajá, y yo. Ah, acá en la parte de arriba. Ah, no, no me entendía. 
Sí, yo no, no lo entendía ya no. tampoco. <risa> Le salen mal, será error de, de, del enlace o no, no sé. No le puse esa que no había hecho de la cuatro y usted me dice, me dijo una cosa y yo esa puse y me salió mala. All right. Some people are still in the breakout rooms. We are waiting for them. Okay, everybody is back. Como les fue? 10, de, 10 out of 10. <laughs> everybody got 10. 8 out of 10. <laughs> 10 out of 10. Yes, good. <laughs> Don't tell me you get less than that, please. It was so easy. Okay, here we have some other activities. Number one. Play tennis. He's playing tennis. <laughs> He's playing tennis. Number two. Ride a bike. Uh -huh. In incomplete sentence. He's flying. He's flying. He's, He's riding a bike. Riding a bike. Uh -huh. He is riding a bike. Aquí la acción como tal se llama ride a bike. Pero si ya la ponemos en ING, present continuous, he is riding a bike. He is playing tennis. He is running. She is running. She is running. He is swimming. He is swimming. She is walking. She is Taking a, taking a walk. She's taking a walk. Uh -huh. They are dancing. They, they are dancing. They are, dancing. They are dancing. remember, they're dancing. They are. He is. She is. Uh -huh. She's he driving. Is driving. They go to the movies. They are going to the movies. They are going to the movies. He's shopping. He's shopping. shopping. She is shopping. She's reading. She's reading. She's reading. She's studying. She's studying. She's watching television. She's watching TV. Watching television. Right. Okay. Como tal, ustedes acaban de hacer affirmative sentences. In present continuous. Si ya quiero hacer una oración negativa, solo le agrego el not. Es tan sencillo, yes? He's not playing tennis. He's play not tennis. playing ping pong, right? He's not playing basketball. He's not playing volleyball, right? He's playing okay. tennis. Uh -huh. He's riding a bike. He's not riding a motorcycle. He's not riding a horse, yes? She's running. She's not cooking. She's not dancing. Okay, ahí ya tenemos dos estructuras, affirmative and negative. Bye. Déjenme mover este slide. Esto es parte también de la misma actividad. 
Si yo fuera ajá, a preguntar sobre ask and answer questions about the pictures in part A, is he playing soccer? No, he's not. What's he doing? He's playing tennis. Yes. So is he playing soccer? No, he's no. not. Right? What's he doing? He's, he's playing, playing tennis. tennis. Vale, tenemos dos reyes. Yo les sugiero que hagan el primero que es hacer una oración afirmativa describiendo tal cual lo que está sucediendo y una negativa. Ahí pueden ser creativos. Obviamente aquí nada es escrito en piedras. Vale mucho la interpretación. Por ejemplo, yo podría decir She is reading a book. She is not reading the Bible. Or she is reading a book. She is not sleeping. Es totalmente válido. Right? Ok. Y a la hora de hacer las questions, is he, is she, porque ya estamos haciendo una yes, no question, yes. Is he playing soccer? Imagínense que quiero hacer la question sobre ella. Is she cooking? No, she's not. What's she doing? She is reading a book, yes, or she's reading. Y ya estamos bien. ¿Y se entiende el exercise? Yes. yes. Ok, first, rétense a hacer affirmative and negative sentence. Luego, hacer yes, no questions and wh question. Yes. Is he, is she. Y si fueran ellos, ¿cómo sería? They. They. Ajá, en question. Are they? Are, are they, they going to the stadium? No, they're not. What are they doing? They are going to the movie. Yes? Entonces voy a convertir ambas slides, aunque ustedes tienen el manual, igual yo creo que ya están familiarizados. Déjenme. Les pongo con alguien más. Yes. Good. Let's go. Permítame ahorita. Que se nos hizo el compañero, se nos fue. Se nos fue, quizás tiene mal la conexión. <risa> se nos fue, ¿verdad? Empezaré yo entonces. Ok. Eh... And... He's playing tennis. Mm -hmm. He's driving a bike. Sí, 
también le toca usarlo físicamente y podemos ser Sin embargo, lo que ocurre es que es un jugador defensivo extraordinario. No le puede hacer un sorteo. Probablemente los cinco o seis jugadores del mundo no hay que sorteo. Eh, el problema es que todavía no tiene. Pile Tucker puede estar pensando en la que todavía no eh, Pero no. Como, no sé cómo decir, pues, vamos una cada uno. Uh -huh. Vaya, por lo menos ya vamos, ya hicimos estos dos ejemplos, vamos por la tercera. Voy a, conte voy a hacer las preguntas yo y vos me contestás. Luego vos haces la pregunta a esta y que te conteste Erika. Uh -huh. Ok. Uh -huh. Entonces sería. Is, y, ok. Eh, te, te pregunto entonces: ¿Is she playing video games? No, no. she doesn't. Okay. What's she doing? She is running. Ahí está. Voy a hacerle la, la siguiente que sería esta. Hacer las preguntas vos y que las conteste Erika. Yes, tell me. Mm, si quiero poner, eh, está cantando salsa y singing salsa. Yes. Yes. Quiere pensar pues, con la primera. Sí. En afirmativa y en negativa la respuesta y de ahí qué está haciendo. Okay. De la primera sería he's playing tennis, he's not playing tennis. En la pregunta sería is he Playing tennis. Para contestar, yes, he is. Una otra pregunta, what's he doing? La negativa es no, she's not running. She's not Hola. Uh -huh. Es que la primera, la negativa sería de cambiar, ¿verdad? Lo que no está haciendo. Ajá, como Ajá. ella, el ejemplo ahí, el primero, ¿cómo uh -huh. sería para usted? He's playing tennis. Él está jugando tenis, ¿verdad? Sí, la negativa Oye, sería por ejemplo. Uh -huh. Cuando le pone he's not, él no está jugando tenis. ¿No es así? Sí, sí. He's, he's not playing tennis. ¿Es así o estamos mal? Es que, <risa> bueno, yo el tío, según, lo que yo entendí, según lo que yo entendí, era cambiar la acción que estaba haciendo, porque la primera es negativa, para responder negativo. Por ejemplo, la de la tercera ejemplo, puedo poner 
she is dancing. O sea, ella está bailando. Porque la primera es negativa. Entonces podríamos, she, no, she's not. O sea, ella no está bailando. La segunda sería la correcta. She is running. Yes, she, she is running. Según lo que yo entendí. Ah, yo entendí eso, okay. pero para hacer las questions. Las preguntas. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ay, que no era la misma. Ay, que está yo, yo no me dejo ir nada. <risa> no, ahorita ya me confundí. <risa> no, mejor sigamos las haciendo como están haciendo. Más es que yo las confunda. Dele, dele, dele. Sí, sí, sí. A ver. Y después preguntamos a ver qué nos dice ella, ¿verdad? <risa> Sí. sí, porque yo no escuché nada. No, yo por hasta ha estado lloviendo también y los las calles que estaban cayendo. Sí, sí. Vaya, entonces sí, el 4 con... donde es Win que está nadando, ¿verdad? ¿Cómo sería ahí uh -huh. la, la positiva? La eh, uh -huh. ¿Es ella o él? Él. Es. Karen. She doing. My turn the question. Okay. La siguiente en reversa. Okay. She is swimming. Eh, la otra compañera se conteste para que todos hablen. Sí. ¿Cómo la she is, she is swimming. La anterior a la que está es. Este... Está ahí. Uh -huh. En el que está en el señor. Eh, yes. No. Es um, la anterior a esa. Ajá, uh -huh, we talking with she. No sé si se ve. La de pelo, pelona. Pelo, pelo. <laughs> 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 okay. Eh, tenía... yes, she's no, este... swimming, no, pregunté. She's not swimming. What are she doing? ¿Qué está haciendo? La que está haciendo? Ahí dice, así como la contestó en hoy, como la dijo en hoy, así mismo. She is Um, en una se le va a agregar el ING el ING uh -huh. sí, porque no todas cambian ¿no? ¿ah? no todas cambian no ellos they are <clears throat> They terminan en el en este ya, ya solo se le cambia el ING. Quiero una pregunta. Eh, en esta parte donde dice go to the movies, uh -huh. eh, ¿dónde se le podría agregar el ING? Porque si usted el go le agrega el ING, ya no sería como... O sea, se podría decir de diferente forma, porque entonces ya no sería going, sino que sería going to, y ahí sí, o sea, ya estaría como hablando de futuro. No, es siempre el, el present continuous, porque si fuera el futuro, después del going to, necesita otro verbo. Por ejemplo, si usted dice el going to, dice I'm going to work tomorrow, y ahí no, simplemente están yendo al cine, they are going to the movies. Uh -oh. O sea que para, para el 
para, para crecer bueno, así, por, así poder, por, ¿no? por ajá por, por entender o sea de, eh, tiene que estar tiene que usar usted el going to antes y después tiene que usted poner el verbo en caso de que vaya a ser una acción en el futuro ajá uh -huh. a menos que usted dijera they are going to watch a movie Ahí se sería futuro. Pero igual siempre lleva, siempre lleva el verbo después. Exacto, porque si quiere decir una acción en futuro. Pero si solo dice, they are going to the movies, solo están yendo ahorita para el cine. Oh. La verdad que ya lo entendí un poco, pero igual siempre. Sí, es que tiende a confundirse por el mismo going to. Pero que ese no, no estamos usando el going to ahorita como, como auxiliar. Simplemente es el verbo ir. Uh -huh. y, por, más, y que está en por, progress. Por, por eso le decía, o sea, me siento algo confundido quizá. Por lo Suena, mismo. ajá, porque, porque es el mismo verbo. Y tiende a confundirse con el futuro. Pero en este caso no es el del futuro. Simplemente es el verbo ir siendo usado en progressive. Ahorita sucediendo, continuos. Ok. Yes. Si fuera el del futuro, después del tú, necesito un verbo. Y movies no es un verbo. Eso ya sería como complemento. Ajá. Por Entonces, eso. por ejemplo, ya del futuro sería, por ejemplo, I'm going to walk in tomorrow. I'm going to walk. Tomorrow. I'm going to, I'm going to study go. tomorrow. I'm ah, going ya, to ya, play. Ya lleven, uh -huh. ya lleven el primer verbo, no es un segundo verbo. Uh -huh. En ese caso se convierte el going to en un auxiliar. Ah, y el uh -huh. otro verbo ya se pone normal. En base form se pone normal, exacto. Uh -huh. Bueno, nos toca regresar. Es too late. <risa> Ya todo regresado. Everybody return? No yet. Todavía se me han quedado algunos. En los breakout Casi. rooms. Almost, almost. Hello, hey. ¿Cómo Space les fue? Seis. Back to you. <laughs> Bye. No Bye. logramos Bye. llegar hasta el reading, pero thank you very much. I appreciate it. You were such a nice you. group. Hazel, when I talk to you. <laughs> Raise your hand, huh? Tell me, Hazel. Bonito es tirar la pelota, teacher. <laughs> <laughs> what happened in no, that okay. group? Yeah. Okay, Suspicious. Es que hey. Armando me comentaba que, que, que sería agradable que todos nos reuniéramos en común en algún lugar. Para platicar con ustedes o hagan algo. Tal vez. Sí. Para todos en persona. Mantengan los contactos. It would be nice. El grupo de WhatsApp no se va a deshacer. Ese lo cierran, pero pueden antes de que lo cierren, porque de aquí a mañana quizás no les da chance. Quiero ver. Sí, mañana más tardar en la tarde ya lo han cerrado. Así que pueden ahorita como. Copiar los contactos y keep in contact. And you create one group. Oiga, que el otro Pero, nivel no ajá. nos daría a usted, dicha. I don't know. Eso sí no lo sé. Lo pediremos. Me, me, me tocas un poco la fortune a mí. Sí, pero thank you very much. I appreciate it. It was very nice. Si quieren, nos tomamos una picture. Dejo de compartir. Yeah. Todos los que nunca se mostraron. Ah. No, no, los de Armenia que no se bañaron. Que no tenemos. Ay, oiganlo. Qué malo. 
Bye, ready? Tomorrow pose. The best pose, 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 pose. One, two, three. Ahí está, quiero ver si la compartimos. Entonces, en lo que, en lo que, por favor, a los del grupo, los que estén interesados y quieran salir a conocer, en el grupo, por favor, no se sé, pongan un emoji o algo para anotarlos y hacer el otro grupo. Pues sí, Vania Heisen, para que haya el grupo. Exacto. Ay, qué, qué bonito dejarme todo el trabajo. Bonito, bonito, bonito. Es el precio de ser un líder. Yes. Bien, bien. Siempre lo he sabido. Si, si tiene buen leadership de skill, decir. le toca trabajar de más. Yes. Yes. Pero, o si no, perfil bajo, nada. Yes. Yes. Sorry. Y entonces, teacher, me gustaría, como ya esta es la última posible vez que nos veamos, ojalá que no, agradecerle, no teacher, ir, por su paciencia. No, Deja de ser motivación. Gracias, oiga, teacher, por todo. No. La apreciamos mucho. Me Thanks for the teachers and for every hour to hear. And yes. I wanna say see you in the future thank you me too thank, thank you sure. de verdad que son un gran grupo keep keep studying keep Do working cry, please. yes i know <laughs> <laughs> i know no me gusta Anything. la despedida <laughs> pero hopefully we can see you we can keep in touch that would be great eh, la agregamos yeah. también para la salida mm -hmm. yes sure yeah. Thank you. Hopefully <laughs> tengo tiempo para si me quede chance. Because no, I, o sea, I, sería de, 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 de hablar y poner un tiempo más o menos que todos podamos. The weekend. Mm -hmm. por exactly. Uh -huh. Por eso te digo, pero hay gente que de veramente, por ejemplo, vaya, estamos escuchando que hay gente que de veramente es de, de sí, San, Miguel, San Miguel, pues y tendría que ser en un lugar, pues. O sea, Digamos, ah, eso, es, sí. eso es lo que, que platicamos de buscar uh -huh. un lugar que quede algo céntrico para todos pues o sea es de buscar un lugar no es que tal vez más de alguno le va a quedar más cerca que otro pero todos estaríamos más accesibles a llegar pues que sí, para mí me parecería bien o sea para mí me parecería bien no sé si ustedes o sea de reunirnos más que todo quizás en San Salvador pues eso, o de donde sea la mayoría <ríe> No, y ah, es, más, es, más, es más fácil Salvador. llegar a San Salvador porque es más como conocido, por decir así, de que exactly, es un poco sí. más accesible. Standard, exactly. Bueno, nos ponemos de acuerdo en el grupo. Ticos, I have another class. Love you very much. Take care. Okay. God bless you. Bye. Good night. Bye. 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 Bye.